Is this thing on? <laughs> oh my gosh. Did I get it? We back. <laughs> oh. All right. Let's see if we get everyone coming back or not. <laughs> like, ay, ay, ay. Back. We are back. Yay. time please stay connected everything's fine everything is fine <laughs> okay we dared thinking everything was fine that was our mistake honestly the wi-fi slag you shall not stream not on a tuesday i choose the day and it is not today that is that's fun that, that's fun. Okay, well, we're back. We're, we got it. I think we're good. Fingers crossed. Welcome back, everybody. All right. I wasn't here, so I can't say I came back, but I'm here now. Hey, there you go. That works out. <laughs> Welcome. Welcome back everybody we're back again we are back again you have to go i'm in school and have math test today oh good luck lucas sending you all the good vibes that you'll do great on them we believe in you you've got this you got this you got this all right thank you for the lurk i was wondering what happened yeah i said at the uh the beginning of stream how my internet died earlier today and i actually have to like I had to schedule an appointment to have a technician come out and like pay them to fix and install new wires um, to fix my Wi-Fi because it's been kind of starting to have more issues, more issues the last few uh, months. But hopefully, uh, tomorrow them fixing it will actually fix it. That is the goal. We'll see. We hope. It's all we can do is just hope that it works. Matthew, hello, welcome on in. Hope you're doing good. Welcome to the stream. Samantha, hello, welcome on in. All right, love your channel. Hey, thank you so much, Matthew. Thank you, thank you. What's a honk shoe? Well, if you uh, read the little uh, exclamation honk shoe in a certain poster, it's kind of just what we call like sleeping. Cause when you sleep and you snore, you go shoo. Shoo, you know. Oh, and of course, imagine if. Okay, okay. Not okay, not okay. Already chaos, already chaos. Go under the water, red. Froggies, I'll be back for you. Where did it go? I swears. What a what a good what a good little welcome back to stream. Anybody else? Anybody else? Wee, 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 wee. I am a good Samantha. My uh, my internet has been a little bit crazy today, so um, stream just died. So this is take two, and so far we're doing good. But we're uh, we're collecting tadpoles to breed them up, so that's exciting. We're gonna get some little friends, but. Let's see. We have enough. Like, we don't need more than this. So we'll grab this last little bunch. And then we'll call that good. Um, I technically, like, don't need a whole lot more than this. But these are the frogs that I'm going to have um, in the different biomes. And then I need at least one of each. Because I want to bring them into the nether to make frog lights. So we do need some more. But for the sake of like bringing them to our base area. We got enough in the bucket. But now we just get to chill and wait for the other guys. Our other little friends. So it's always fun. I couldn't see it as my keyboard was blocking it on your phone. Oh I see I see. No that makes sense. Yes. But yeah that's a, a honk shoe was just like a fun little sound. I like had seen another streamer that was playing Stardew. They said 
Hongshu when like one of the, the reviewers had to like leave to go to bed. And I was like, that's so funny. And then I told Chad about it one day and then everyone was like, Hongshu, we like it, let's keep it. So I'm like, all right, there we go. We use the Hongshu. Please don't explode the frogs. I don't want to explode them either. Shoresh good. Frog name idea, white variant. Yuri for Lily, like the flower. Orange red is Kana for the Kano flower and green for Phil for Clover. Oh, those are fun ones. I, there is a chance I will forget that those names were mentioned because streamer brain. So after the stream or on one of my videos, comment the name suggestions. Um, so that I remember, but we could just also name them um, on stream today. I just often forget, so typing them in like the comments below so I like see them after the fact is also helpful. The option to become a member isn't showing its, itself. Oh, sure. Um, I think it's weird, but I don't think that on mobile it shows up. Like I think you have to be on a computer for it to show up from my understanding. Um, at least that's what I've heard. I don't know if someone in chat can see the join button on their mobile device and can kind of direct, but for a while there, that's what I thought was the uh, the thing. Does that count as a red noise? Mm, um, I'm gonna say no. <laughs> uh. I love your face. Thank you so much, Samantha. I appreciate it. I'm just scrolling down through chat since we get some time. Yeah, it's a mobile thing. Okay, gotcha. I'd like heard that and like, I don't usually see it when I'm on mobile, like if I'm watching YouTube. So that's what I assumed. You can find it through browser. Okay, so you can be on your phone. You just have to go to youtube.com on your browser and log in to then join through the browser. Okay, it shows well on mobile, okay. Gabby, hello, welcome on in. Hope you're doing good. I shall note it down. I shall not forget. Shall not forget the honk shoes. <laughs> oh yeah, Sada had a good idea. Or the, the pet name ideas for the frogs in our Discord. You can, uh, I have like a name suggestion channel specifically for things like this. Good reminder, Sarah. Good reminder. Appreciate it. Bun, bun, bun. And thank you also for, for plugging the Discord side. I appreciate it. I guess I never really needed these, so I'm just gonna like clean up my mess as soon as these little fr little tadpoles come to come into the world. And I can probably just bring these two home. It's just gonna be a pain because I have to go through this. Um, so we'll see, we'll see if we decide to do that. Technology, a browser to become a member when you already have YouTube open. Yeah, it seems a little weird. Like you'd think like YouTube would, um, you know, have it a little bit more together than that. But you know, it might just be like, they have to make a whole new app, right? So like they might, or uh, like update the entire app. So it might not be something they wanna do. I can see it on the YouTube app though. Wait, really? I wonder if it's just like the version of the app you have downloaded. That could be a thing. Yeah, the guy's, the guy's moving again. He's doing his little spinny spins. They're so cute. Interesting though, yeah. You can just go to the main page of the channel on mobile. Oh, okay. Good to know. Good to know, good to know. YouTube app is what I'm on. Okay, interesting. So that's good to know that it does show up. Just going to the main channel is probably the easiest way to do that. Interesting, interesting. All right, come on, little tadpoles. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna spawn any day now. Just waiting, waiting with our friends. That says, say, I say mobile funny. You say mobile. I feel like it depends on like where you're from, you know. I say mobile. Some people say mobile. Frog starts to spin. Me, you spin me around. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Start playing songs that technically aren't. Um, oh, there they are. Aren't uh, stream approved for DMCA and just. 
verbiage. <laughs> Song verbiage. <laughs> okay, we got four, we got enough. So let's put these guys in their little buckets. Their bucket bucket. As the advancement goes. Come here, little guy, and come here. Okay, so I'm curious what variants of frogs end up uh, spawning in our, our actual base. So I think we go find that out. Cause I, I'm not sure. I'm gonna leave these guys, he, these ones here just to make sure that like I have frogs. Oh, hello. Why did that go so slowly? Okay. Whoa, that was kinda, kinda neat. I'm trying to just like get up on top of this tree just so I can kind of, um, Oh, that didn't, okay. Get it on, on the tree and then just fall right away. All right, I just wanted to like put a little like beacon so I remember where they are, you know? Just cause finding them was so difficult. Just gonna put a little torch. Cause then even if I can't fully remember, I at least have that and they're kind of in the open. <laughs> uh, so hopefully I can remember where they be. Or you could call the white frog spinny. I could call them spinny. They they do be like that. They do like who spins. I don't know why these guys are white, but it's helpful no desert trip. Oh my gosh. Losing them in the desert would be so bad. Why is there a sheep? Um, buddy, how did you spawn up here? <laughs> why? How did he get up here? Um... What? How? How? How did you do that? That is, the sheep is king of the world. I guess so, this is hilarious. You should take him with you, he's magical. He is magical. The thing is, unless I make a staircase, if I try leading him, he will be a magical piece of wool with mutton. Uh, if I try to go down. There's his buddy though. Oh, I guarantee he um, somehow stayed on a vine the whole time. I guarantee that's what happened. Like, which one of these vines actually goes to the ground? Guys, I totally guarantee that he just, like, climbed these vines all the way up here. <laughs> he looks like he, if he was a goat, he would yeet me off. Do you see it? He's looking. He, he wants to push me. Do you see this? He's just waiting. Look at that. It's like he's just wanting to push me. He keeps looking up and down like, should I? No, should I? No, you shouldn't. Mm-mm-mm-mm. mm 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 Sheep climbing by his belongs. Well, he flew up there. Oh, yes, sorry, yes. You're so right. He definitely flew his way up there. Definitely, definitely. Anyone catch the wheelie mod name? It's Mouse Wheelie. That's what I, it's called. My favorite mod for like quality of life, I would say. Like you don't need it, but it's just so, so nice. Okay, now I'm curious to be putting these little guys inside the little pond with my axolotls. They always get crammed into spots. Like two of them are stuck in here from what I remember, which I don't know why they got stuck here. Like, I don't think they should get stuck in a block, but they're like kind of stuck in a block. Like there, see, like, I don't know why they got stuck. Ooh. But I have all of them. There's two of them. But yeah, they all just kind of got stuck sometimes. So it was kind of strange that they were stuck. Don't exactly know why that was the case. We'll just try to keep them unstuck. But yeah, like this guy's also stuck. Like, I don't get it. Like, do you need the block gone? Like, I don't know. It was, it's it's weird. But yeah, okay. We got our little friends back and out. We should make him a mascot for this world. He could be a mascot. The dancing, the dancing dude, as we could call him. All right, we're gonna sweep in the house. He's a magic sheep, bros a climber. Yeah, Archie had it right, it's Mouse Wheelie. 
Got pandas outside sniffing. We've got our birdies. We've got Arashi and Sora just hanging in their little bird house. They've got their little bird bath. All right, we're gonna see what we get. What's interesting is this is jungle, but there's river. Like some of this is jungle. I think we could maybe get two variants in here. I can't remember how many. See, like this is river, so I guess if they come over here. But this is mostly jungle. All the way around the corners, because some of the, the leaves change color. All right. Let's do three in here and see what we get. I swear if you eat- <gasps> I'm in shock. I I did not know that about that mechanic. Oh my gosh. We watched a tadpole murder happen. All that work. It was only one? Oh my goodness. I, <laughs> I can't believe we just saw that. <laughs> Poor little tadpole. F, yeah. But it's two stumps to be the am. I didn't know that was a thing. Did you know that was a thing? Oh my gosh. I don't like him anymore. Yeah, seriously. I thought the axolotls were all cute all the time. No. They murdered by a little tadpole. My gosh. Oh my word. I. Yeah, that, that happened. <laughs> what the heck? What the heck? Oh no, my my Wi-Fi might be going out again if it goes out. I hope it's I hope it's okay. It's saying YouTube's not receiving enough um, info to keep a smooth stream. So hopefully um, you still have stream, Maggie. So just warnings. Poor little tadpole. Hi, Red in chat. I don't know what just happened. So welcome in Mzam. I just learned if you put a tadpole in with axolotls the axolotls eat the tadpole so i'm trying to grow some cute little frogs and i thought i could just add them into here and this pink one our little friend which one are you sakura ate my tadpole like a savage a little goon so now we're moving we're, we're changing our plants. We're not letting our little tadpoles grow in there. Um, yeah, so figured that out the hard way. <laughs> we lost a tadpole. <laughs> is the stream lagging? Here's my Wi-Fi. I think my stream is lagging again. Um, if it keeps lagging, guys, I might honestly just... Guys, it's not the best experience, so I may or may not just... Um, this is jungle in this block all the way yeah but it's just uh, it might be lagging oh no red's on repeat on my stream oh no i'm so sorry guys let's see red sacrifice of tadpole to the axolotl yep i didn't mean to did not mean to all right if you can hear me type a one in chat i'm curious if you guys can hear me Stream is pretty laggy. Okay, we might, um, if you can hear me. You can, okay, so people are hearing me. Okay. Do anything, okay. I'm I'm debating if I should just call it or if it was decent enough for you guys to deal with or if it's just too annoying. We might just uh, call it. This is a river. What would a river biome be? Do we know? What, what kind of little friends would we, would we get in a river? I'm kind of curious for that now. I can't anymore. Oh no, it's all good. Is it back? 
Oh man, it's going in and out. Not good. It's lagging a bit more though. The Wi-Fi is going anime protagonist mode refusing to fall. Yeah, really. It's just buffering a bit. Don't worry, Red. Okay. Yeah, if it's if it's uh, buffering, just try refreshing the stream on your end to see if that fixes it. It was to check if her audio was okay. All right. If it continues to be a problem that keeps interrupting like us kind of like chilling and hanging out in stream, I might just end stream earlier than usual because I don't want to just, you know, have our entire stream be me checking like, is it lagging? How about now? Is it lagging? How about now? Like, is it buffering? How about now? You know, you know, not exactly uh, what we want, but I don't want it to be like, a bother for you guys, you know? Refresh and better, it's good again. Okay, okay. Why don't you... Why don't... When you don't move, it gets considerably, considerably better. So guys, this is the rest of stream. I, I don't move. I zoom, but I don't move. <laughs> that shouldn't be the issue though, which is interesting. That'll make for an interesting stream loop, right? Oh my gosh, I know. The second one I might not put up. We'll see if I end up doing it. But guys, thank you for leaving the likes on the second one and being here for the second one. I appreciate it. If you do and early, we understand no matter what, we still enjoy what you do. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Mountain. I appreciate it. Honestly, Red could entertain the audience even by not moving up. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. Quite the compliment. <laughs> so thank you. We're playing a game of freeze tag. Exactly, Santa. We're just playing a game. Yeah, we'll go with that. Definitely not just my own issues with Steam. Yeah. Well, okay. We do have to wait to see what kind of tadpoles we get in the jungle. So I say we just kind of hang out by these guys. We have two of them, right? And uh, they should be okay. But I might just like look up what kind they are. But I kind of am just curious to kind of hang by them and just see what we get. And we can just like chat in the meanwhile, right? Just freestyle a stand-up routine. <laughs> yeah, that'll go so well. <laughs> you think it was just a coincidence? Okay, gotcha. It's 1.30 a.m. here in Denmark, but I can't sleep. So it's very nice that you are streaming. Oh my goodness. Well, I hope uh, you get your sleep when you're able to get your sleep. But I'm glad that in the meanwhile, the streams can be helpful chickens in the oven where we at wayward hello we we're uh we're testing to see what the uh the jungle biome is for the froggies so we're just kind of hanging out by these two um actually i want three so we're gonna add another one into the mix r.i.p because of the darn the darn axolotl but at least now we can breed them up in this area you know but we're just gonna see what uh, what kind of froggies we get. I feel like this is a warm biome. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. All right, take all our sugar cane so they have space. Alrighty, now they can't get out. Okay, stream went back to telling me it's in excellent condition. So that is good that the, the Wi-Fi on my end is going back to normal. Glad for that, we love that. Hello, welcome in, Yuda. Hope you're doing well. Pyro, hello, welcome back. Hi, Red, I'm a new fan and I've been watching every single one of your videos to fall asleep and I love them. Ah, thank you so much, Angel. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. I've been having some Wi-Fi issues for those of you just coming in here. Um, usually my Wi-Fi is perfectly fine. This week it's been on the fritz, so someone's coming to fix it tomorrow, but I'm noticing the issues today. So if you notice it um, lagging at all, just refresh your YouTube and um otherwise it could be on my end but we're just hanging out waiting for these little tadpoles to hatch so it's a fun time it's a fun time and welcome in prince hope you're doing well that'll be warm so the blue white one it's a warm biome so we do get the white one okay that's what we're trying to figure out it's your birthday on the 22nd of april so i'll be uh, older next stream next year big birthday Ooh, exciting. Well, happy early birthday, Ben. It's very exciting. I can sleep tomorrow. It's more fun to be here right now. Ah, well, I am very glad, Cecil. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Don't you have any plans? I, I'm i planning to do a little bit of terraforming. Do you mean like this river? Or which river did you mean? 
because I at some point I would just like to kind of like close this off because this is just like pretty deep cave like it has little like noodle caves in it but I just want to kind of like make this more of a basin and then just put a bunch of seagrass and mossify this whole riverway and like close some of these up because it would be fun to have some um I'll take the night vision off it would be fun to have some axolotls in here as well but I just need to get rid of all these big caves because I'd lose all my axolotls so that's the like only plans that I have so far all right we sleep by the axolotls sweep by our fans all of our little pandas hanging out I'm really curious what these are gonna be so people are guessing that they're the white ones I I can like google it up you know and like figure out what it is but you know we'll just we'll just wait and see Bendy hello Oh, come on in. Bump. Cold biomes are green, tempered are the orange ones, so swamps got it, and warm biomes get the blue, white blue ones. Okay, gotcha, good to know. Maybe you need a new router, that's what my mom had to do because her Wi-Fi kept saying connected without internet for weeks. Yeah, Destiny, that's the, the same problem that I've been having. Um, I told them that I think it could be a new router. They're gonna try installing new wiring and seeing if that fixes it otherwise i'm gonna buy a new router like modem and see if that fixes the issue so that is the plan but yeah i'm pretty sure it is a modem thing but we'll see hopefully it gets fixed in the end that is the goal yeah yeah i for real can't sleep either so red is always coming in clutch ah what well, thanks guys i'm glad that i can be some entertainment as it is harder to sleep for some of you. You found a koi fish texture pack. Ooh, that's very fun. If I'm not mistaken, the texture pack changes the textures of the salmon to koi. Oh, okay, that's super cool. It's fun when people come up with those texture packs and it's just like armor to be mushroom armor. It is so cute. And it changes your tools, your diamond tools to be mushroom tools. It's, it's so cute. And I'm, I may or may not be using that in um, a video, a one-off video that I'm working on. So, right. Heige is the proper word for red streams lives. People, I've heard that word before, but I always forget what it means. I don't often see streamers on uh, Wi-Fi though. Isn't a wired connection much stabler? It is more stable. Um, where my uh, desk is now positioned, it's not by a location where it can be on the ethernet like hardwired. So I, unfortunately, I changed where my desk was before I had it hardwired and then now it's on Wi-Fi and now I'm kind of thinking that like, I might try to see Huga. Oh, that's how you say it. Okay, I googled it. It's a uh, Danish and Norwegian word that describes a cozy, contented moon evoked by comfort and conviviality. I'll, I'll take the, the coziness. I like it. Hygge. 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 Is that how you say it? <laughs> That's my, my attempt. Why does it say number two? My Wi-Fi died on me. So uh, this was my take two. Um, I'm gonna move it to the end. Just because if people are just joining now, they might not really notice that it's like the take two part. But yeah, so my, um, the first stream lagged out cause my Wi-Fi literally just like disconnected completely. <laughs> so it's, it's, it's been great. But we've just been vibing. We're just, you know, hanging with the little, the little tadpoles and the froggos. Ba -da -bum. Close enough. <laughs> I probably butchered it, but you know, we, we try. It is not my native language, so I will not have the ability to get the correct accents or like saying it and pronouncing it correctly, but I try. That's actually pretty spot on your pronunciation. Is it now? You know, I'll, I'll take it. I appreciate the kindness in my pronunciation of words. 
Um, usually to change armor into mushroom armor, just change the name of the armor. Oh, sure. Yeah, the specific texture pack I found, it's um, it's just like a, a texture pack you just like have to like toggle on, basically, like in your like resource pack settings, you have to like apply it. Um, but I have seen the ones where you can just rename some of them. Oh my gosh, okay. I couldn't get this um, this mod to work, guys, but there is a mod where you can rename uh, skeleton horses to be white frog, orange frog, or green frog, and you can literally turn the, the skeleton horses with a name tag into rideable froggies. And you can choose the color depending on the name tag you pick. I, I was just so happy. I thought that was the cutest thing, but I could not get it to work with the, the mod pack that I put together. So I was a little bit sad. Did you already find the LA's? I just joined, so I don't know what happened. We have not found the LA's yet. Um, phase one is frogs, and then we're doing our um, LA's. So I can just do uh, hatching frogs first, then looking for LA's. We'll just do a little like pinned thing. Welcome in. All right, but yeah, that's kind of the, the plan. We'll just do a pinned comment. What, that's so cool. Yeah, Jennifer, I I was like, I was just like looking for more like cottagecore mods and I stumbled across that one and I thought it was so cool. All right, let me pin a comment, pin my message. Did that go up there? Welcome in, we're hatching frogs first and looking for lace. Yes, it did. Oh my goodness, Dino Nuggy. Thank you so much for becoming a tier one member. Thank you, thank you. Can we get some hype in chat for Dino Nuggy becoming a member? Yay, yay, yay. Dino, now you get all the access to the the little emotes. If you have Discord, you can um, hook up now your Discord and get the, the role for being a YouTube member. Get access to the, the little channels and all the things. But welcome and thank you for becoming a member. I appreciate the support. All the hype, exclamation hype, woo! LA's take no time to get, so even if we happen to run out of time or get trapped by Wi-Fi issues, it would be easy to get them off camera. True, yeah, they don't take super long, which is nice. I feel like these guys, I'm pretty sure tadpoles take like 20 minutes to hatch, which is a while. Um, yeah, okay, so if the cold biomes, maybe... They'll be out of range, but we could just go set up some tadpoles in um, a different setting. So if we think these are going to be the white ones, we need orange. So, ow, it just hits my trees. We're going to go back towards spawn because I have a little like station set up where I was getting the different fragos. We don't have any slime balls. We, we do have slime balls. Yes. We have some slimes, but I have this shulker box is already full of tadpoles. So we already bred up the tadpoles that we would need. So now we're just uh, going to the locations to do the different um, hatching of the fragos. Matthias, hello. It's good to see you. Hope you have been well. Welcome on in. We're, we're hatching frogs to get the different variants to bring them back to my house. And yeah, that's what we've done so far. Um, my Wi-Fi has been on the fritz today. It's been a great time. So if the stream gets a laggy, feel free to refresh. Hit the like button. Indeed. Thank you, Lily. Yes, yes. If uh, you haven't given it a like, please give the stream a like. It really helps, especially since this is take two because stream lagged out. I appreciate it. All right, so this is technically a beach. So, would this be? T Hang on. How to become a member? If you do, oh yeah, exclamation mark member. Archie just did it. Thank you. 
<laughs> Red, what would happen if we took your main channel and your second channel and merged them? Would we get the little purple? You know, going off of color standards, mixing the little red and the little blue, we would probably get the little purple. Hypothetically, it's the Japanese inspired world. Yes, the Japanese inspired world. But uh, becoming a member, if you're on your mobile, uh, depending on the update of your mobile device you have, if you go under my channel name specifically, it might tell you how to become a member there. Otherwise, you need to be on your browser on YouTube if you're on mobile, if it doesn't show, or on your like computer. But yeah, there's a link that allows you to just click the join now and it directs you. So if that doesn't work, hopefully it would. All right, well, I think, I think, okay. If I put frogs here, are we gonna get orange ones if we're on a beach? Or should I do uh, the savannah? What would the beach ones be? Are they gonna be orange? I can't remember. Do you guys remember? Which, which frog colors? Is this near warm or cold ocean? This, what, what would this be? I don't know. This is all just gonna say beach. This is all just saying beach. Lukewarm ocean. So this is by lukewarm. So we'd be by a warm biome, but I just don't know if this beach is gonna be temperate or not. Oh, and I need to sweep. I need to honk shoe. Oh no, I left my bed. I left my bed. Ah. Do I have? Do I have? Oh, another thing I should keep on hand is um some some wools. Okay, all right. We're going to our village and we sweep there. Cecil becoming a member. Thank you so much as well for becoming a member today. I appreciate you supporting the channel. You can use all of the, the cute little mushy emotes in the YouTube live chat and commenting on videos. But thank you so much for becoming a member. We're getting that exclamation mark hype in chant. Love to see it. Don't love to see that. So we, we fly away quickly, ever so quickly. We don't like to see the bad guys. Cold ocean waters like at swamp would give green. So cold ones give green. Orange frogs are lukewarm waters and hot water is the white. Okay, so this would be orange, I would assume. So let's give some, oh, let's do some, some of these guys. All right. And then, yeah, there we go. Ben's got all the little little emotes. He's got them going, showing them off. And um, if you also have a Discord, you can join the Discord and you get the the YouTube member role. If it's a uh, if you link it up, but welcome, new member, and you get a nice little mushy by you. You got a little FOMO. I want the cute emotes too and to support you, Red, of course. Ah, well, thank you so much. It's definitely fun, you know, to have the emotes and like the fun things and a little mushy by the name. So I appreciate uh, you being willing to support. It's been a while for me. Have you started to stream any other games? Welcome, Dino. Glad to have you. Um, I haven't streamed any other games on the second channel. I actually was out of town for almost half of March, so I didn't stream at all in March. So last week was the first time I'm back uh, to streaming. So this is the second stream since I've been back. So I haven't streamed a lot of other games. Um, oh, my Wi-Fi might be on the fritz again. So if it's lagging or being weird, guys, I uh, don't mind it. Hopefully it'll be back. I'm kind of just checking it. It might just be lagging, so if you notice it lagging, feel free to refresh. See if that helps it out. We need neutral biomes for orange frogs. Okay. Good to know. I feel like a beach would be neutral and, like, lukewarm. River, beach, non-snowy taiga. Okay. So rivers and beaches are for the orange ones. Got it. Okay. We got it. So we're getting our little our little green ones because we're in the frozen peaks. So we're getting the green ones. And I wonder if I can like try to be in between both of them. 
Did you find out how to do it though? I might be able to like stay close enough that both of these sections are rendered in. Might be able to do it. Hmm. But I haven't uh, started streaming any other games. Me and Rebel are in the process of starting up a duo hardcore world. So that'll be the other thing we'll be streaming. Oh no. Oh. Hang on. My monitors just shut off on me. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. I could have just smacked into a wall. I literally, for like those last five seconds, I couldn't see anything. So I just pressed escape to like hopefully be pausing it. Super fun. Love that. So great. Yeah. Yeah. All right. We'll see if this is kind of central. Hua. Oh, wait. Why did it? Why did it get all goofy? Oh. Oh, see? You guys saw that. You saw that with the screens. Yeah? I couldn't see what you saw just now, but I just saw it. <sighs> this is a Tuesday that's acting like a Monday. <laughs> uh, but yeah, the duo hardcore world is uh, its going to be a fun time. We'll see how long we, we get the, you know, last in, in hardcore. All right, so I think I have both sides of these rendered in. So I think our little tadpoles sh yeah, maybe not. Maybe they're not rendered in. Do I still see the little guys? Yeah, I saw that. You did see that? Okay. Yep. All of a sudden, I was like, oh, I thought my power went out again. Because my power went out today already once. All right. I don't think they're going to render in. I don't think I can load them both. But now we've got them in the, the sections. Yeah, I did, but I'm too poor at the moment to afford a membership for now. Oh, no worries at all. I know not everybody has capacity to be a member. So literally just you guys being in the streams and liking the videos in the streams and like commenting and like supporting that way helps a ton um no one's ever expected to become a member because i know not everyone has the financial capacity so never feel like pranked it's fine though okay wait oh i do have three i was like did one of them like hop the the wall Cause now it's making me think I should just like raise this up in case one of them tries to hop the wall. Like, oh look at the fishies. There's two of them there, just just hanging out. We got a little technical difficulties. Yeah, that was that was fun. I was like, I don't know where I'm gonna fly into, but hopefully me pressing escape will fix it. Not exactly sure. Your computer keeps lagging a lot. It's probably me today. I have someone today tomorrow. So hopefully that'll uh, fix everything. But if it's like, I want to be able to keep streaming and like keep our normal rhythm and schedule right for streaming, but also like it's, I don't want it just to be distracting that I'm just having all these issues. You know, it's not exactly the most professional Minecrafty thing to, or the professional YouTuber streamer thing to have all the issues right now. But at the same time, you know, if people are okay with a little bit of lag, <laughs> uh, then you know we can we can keep trying. You're such a good builder, Ed. I love to get I love getting inspo from you, but they never turn out as good by still trying though. Thank you, Cecil. Honestly, practicing takes the like helps takes things to the next level like the fastest. I definitely haven't always been good at building but just like trying new styles of building and like practicing new things and even like trying the same things i've already tried um just like at different points you know along the way like also is helpful but i would say like getting to just like try things in creative mode or in survival and just kind of follow like even following a tutorial of a build style you're not used to can be helpful because then you kind of like get the feel for where you should be placing the blocks and it kind of helps you to learn like if I want this style of build or the style of roof like this is where I place the things how far I space them so the more you practice those things the more you kind of like learn it and remember it so just practice you know practice makes better always but thank you we're going through it today we're really, really try refreshing the stream it might help yes jennifer i'm so sorry 
Honestly, chat is so chill and nice in here. Ah, well, I'm so glad you think so. I VR <laughs> until I actually owned VR. So that's the uh, the other thing. But I have seen that people um, like that do the life series, like Grian and um, Joel and Jem and like the rest of them are doing the VR one. So I think that's uh, like a fun concept for sure. But red the plus side is that with these issues you're still having fun with us the amazing chat exactly we still vibing you can accelerate the growth time of tadpoles by feeding them slime balls oh that's right i actually that is a fair point i was just not wanting to like use my slime balls because i didn't have a lot of them left but i guess you know we uh we definitely could just give them little snacks hi buddies can i get give you snackies uh, yummies, can I give you a little nut, little slimies? Little snacks? Yeah? We'll just give you a few, because we have other slime to feed to the others. Okay, we can't give you all of them. VR is getting important. It's getting to be like a, I mean, a lot of people are starting to use it for like work. Like if they're doing like, co um, like working from like a, like a Wi-Fi, like remote-based team. It works really well. Jumping around in circles while waiting for something is literally too relatable. I do that so often. Like I do it all the time. You're struggling with finding treasure. Are you looking for like bird treasure maps? It cuts the time bound by 10%. 10% per feeding. Oh, each slime. Interesting, that's good to know. I like that. Thank you, I tend to make my builds too big from the start, so I give up halfway through, so trying to start out smaller. Yes, that is a, a great way to kind of make it more manageable. Um, I always like doing the, uh, the smaller builds. That's what I usually will do, just because I get too overwhelmed by bigger builds. Or I like get burnt out, you know? You're back, what happened to the first stream? My Wi-Fi just turned off. It died, so I unplugged my little modem router and replugged it in, and then here we are. <laughs> I got to go, but this was fun to be back. I'm glad that you enjoyed being a back dino. I uh, appreciate you stopping in, and thank you so much again for becoming a member. Always good to see ya. Have a good rest of your days. Recently made a new world. I found two flower forest fields. Ooh, I love the flower forests. That's definitely one of my favorite biomes because you can get all the flowers. It's so cute. All right, another thing we need to have on the ready. Fences for when these little dudes grow up and get a little bit um, jumpy. I don't want them swimming off into the ocean. Can you imagine? <laughs> the tadpoles looked like they were kissing kind of because they kept on running into each other. Aw, this cute. You know, smooches. Oh, oh, I thought it was gonna bump into each other again. Yeah, they're cute. They're cuties. All right. Now, let's just go see what the ones back at base are. I'm pretty sure none of these are like rendered in enough. That's where we found our sniffer eggs before. Very fun. But we're just gonna see how the ones back home are. This poor bee has been here for so long too. Oh, I've been to that shipwreck. I was like, why is there cobblestone on it? Back, sorry, I had breakfast first. Oh, no worries. No worries, you don't welcome on back. Yeah, I get bored of placing the same blocks over and over again. Yeah, it can get to be a lot. That's why I'll just like take breaks and like go do something else. If I ever just like feel like a project is getting too grindy and just like not interesting, I'll take breaks. You made a new world and died two times. Oh man, dying in a new world is always a little sad because you're like excited, it's a new world, you're collecting all your stuff, and then you just uh, accidentally just die. I love how our little fishing village looks. Seriously, it's so, so nice. Big fan. All right, let's see how these dudes are doing. I'm assuming they haven't grown because neither of these areas are really like rendered into each other. So everyone should still be tadpoles. And I'm just gonna go grab my bed though. But then my storage, let's go check quick. 
Thanks for the advice, Fred. I love you. Ow, no problem. Always happy to give advice. I know sometimes building can feel like a lot. Oh my word, okay. We have all the little slime snackies for our tadpoles. I thought I did not have a lot, but we do have a lot. That's wonderful. That means we can like spam make them grow up. But yeah, I always enjoy building smaller because I feel like I can get very detailed without feeling like it's overwhelming because it's too much. But yeah, hopefully, um, yeah, I'm glad I could be helpful with that. All right, these guys should grow up any, any moment now because we fed them all the slimy balls and normally it just takes like 20 minutes, I thought. So kind of interesting, but we'll see. We'll see uh, how it does. You found lots of loot, keep losing. Oh, sure. Oh, there's one, yes, okay, okay. Yes, we got one. First one, yay. Come here, dude. Hello, yoo-hoo. Okay, you're there. Now we wait for you guys. The Trail Ruin video was perfect one to make a long play. It's such a slow activity, but quite fun. Thank you, Archie. I'm glad you enjoyed, uh, enjoyed that one. Yeah, I thought it would be a fun thing because it's like, you always find new stuff. It's something very chill. It doesn't take like forever, you know? So it's something where it's like, it can be a manageable, like not long. Long play, because some of my long plays in Better Minecraft, I I will admit they are very long. <laughs> so I think I have like one, maybe two. That's at least like, I don't know, almost five hours. And that's just because there's so many cool things to find in Better Minecraft. Oh, we got a second. Hi buddy, come here. There we and then we can just like breed them up from these spots. The stream keeps going out of sync. Yes, uh, that's, I commented on the video too, but I was so happy that you uploaded the Trail Ruins video. I had so much fun. I'm glad you enjoyed watching it. I try to get to all the comments. Sometimes uh, I'm not the best at keeping up with them, but I do try to at least like heart them or like them when I have capacity to. But thank you for commenting. It does help my videos. <gasps> yes, third one. Okay, these guys are good. Now let's go to the next group. I just want them to all be grown-ups <laughs> and then we're gonna bring them back here did i get the stack yes cool two better minecraft pros are roughly five hours yep yeah there's at least two of them they're like really long so i was like a trail ruins you know i'm trying to focus on making them shorter um i think one of the things i was doing before is like i the one thing that's nice about long plays is like you get to see the full like process unedited, you know, like all the different thoughts of like how I'm building things and all of that. Um, but I think I might start editing out certain sections where it's just like, if I'm just like chopping trees for a certain amount of time, I'll just like condense those sections down to make the stream, or not the streams, those long plays a little bit more like manageable for time. So I'm trying to do more of that because I don't want them to be so long that people are like, bruh, I cannot spend that many hours of my day just in one sitting. I know some people like watch a little bit, do their other things in life that's important and then come back later when they have time. So they kind of like come back to it a few different times. But for those that just like to sit down once, you know, it's a little too much because I'll watch long plays, but I also haven't watched a five hour long play yet. So I'm like, maybe because I wouldn't even necessarily watch them. I should, I should change that, so. <laughs> trying to work on that so uh the trail ruins i was like this is a small smaller project it's simple but it's really fun because you get to find cool things and it's the first time i've done it which is also fun so i'm glad um you guys enjoyed that long tangent to say thank you i'm glad you liked it <laughs> i commented on the video too but I was rather, oh I, I tried watching i try wa to watch them all but for some reason the only one was the one video I watched until the end without sleeping. Oh, really? That was the one you watched without falling asleep? Well, I appreciate it, Archie. I appreciate you uh, watching them, even if you fall asleep. I, you know, sleep is important. So if it helps you sleep, that is, that is a good thing. <laughs> but I'm glad you enjoyed that one. 
Yeah, I think I want to try to keep them shorter. So hopefully that'll like help with people wanting to watch them. Eating banana pancakes while watching. Ooh, blue rose. That sounds so tasty. Do you um, use maple syrup on them? Do you use peanut butter on the banana pancakes? Do you have like toppings or are they just tasty so you can eat them plain? But banana pancakes sounds so yummy. I have a, a chai tea next to me, like a legit like, um, like a chai tea bag with some half and half and some raw sugar. I need to watch the recent long play. Don't be disappointed. Oh, <laughs> no worries. I, I'm never expecting you to be like, you know, watch every single video. Cause like everyone has their own life. Life is busy. Things are important in real life. So you're not always going to have capacity to watch them. And that is totally okay. They're, they're there on the channel for when you are able to, or want to watch them. And if you don't, then they're, they're just there. So I just, I just appreciate the support. I do love just like, look at this. Having Swift Sneak 3, I'm just like having so much fun with it. Like I'm I'm so fast. It's like so cool. I've never actually like had Swift Sneak. So it's kind of just fun to like sneak around with it. I do want them to grow up though. So we'll, we'll give them some snackies. Snackies for you. Snackies for you. Okay. Hopefully they will they will grow soon, becoming our friends. I'm always tired, so it's not your fault that I sleep. Oh, well, I hope you're able to get um, like good rest. When you were gone, I got so behind on your videos, but I did get caught up eventually. Uh, well, I appreciate you wanting to uh, get caught up. Thank you, Jennifer, but no worries. Uh, yeah, you know, I was on vacation. You were on video vacation. It's all good. I don't expect everyone to like, watch every single one but you know i appreciate when people make time and see that my videos are like worthy of spending their time on you know but um ba -da, ba -da. i'm trying to keep up with the better minecraft videos but they're so long i took like a week to finish the first one loved it though <laughs> thank you i'm so glad you loved it but yes that's that's part of the reason i'm gonna be try to be better about keeping the long plays to like under like three or on three hours or under i think like that's a good a good time frame like three and a half hours is probably the max that i'm gonna try to keep it with so the one for thursday is like two hours and 50 minutes so hopefully um you know that one's more manageable it's also issues with the wi-fi my wi-fi uh died earlier today and then we got an hour into stream and it died again so if uh, you're noticing issues, <laughs> it's uh, it's ish, ish my Wi-Fi. We're having someone, I'm having someone look at it tomorrow. So we will be okay. We will have it figured out. It will be okay, but it's just been a little funny, funny today. So you will probably get some lag going and you'll experience some buffering. Just the way you're running around while waiting is taking me out. <laughs> it's taking you out. It's just so fun to like use the Swift Sneak 3. Like I haven't had Swift Sneak 3. I think in my 119 series, I found Swift Sneak 2, which like, it, oh, yes, two of you, come here, come here. Yes, all the way up. Yep, there we go, cool. Uh, I think in my 119 series, I only had Swift Sneak 2 is what I was saying. So it's fun to actually have Swift Sneak 3. Cause I go so, I so speedy. It's been pretty good. I just had state testing today, so I'm really tired. Ooh, how did uh, state testing today? <laughs> you said with sarcasm. Um, so I'm guessing you don't like them. <laughs> Come on, little buddy, I believe in you. You want another snacky? Snacky? Yeah? We have one more, one more little dude. They grew up finally, whenever you want to call it. Yep. <laughs> we just need the third one. We just need number three. 
I'm just gonna take some sips of my my tea while we wait. Frog! Yes, princess, we finally got the frogs. We're just waiting for the last little guy. Then we'll be good to go. Very exciting. So, so fun. There we go, we got them all, let's go. We got them all. Okay, now, we just get them all, uh, all caught up. I need to put my, I need to move my teacup so I don't actually knock it over. All right, you're the one that's not connected. Okay, so all three of you are connected now. So we take the bed and we move on to the last ones. Then what we're going to do is these three different sets, we're going to go and move them all back to our area. No, I don't. It was more questions than usual. It's like 51, two of which were essays. Oh no, the essay ones being long are so rough. It's state mandated tests that everyone has to take from third grade and up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the state tests are, are not fun. But I hope that uh, you can kind of, you know, feel a little bit better now that it's out of the way. You're done with them. You can kind of chill now, hopefully. But then <laughs> you said, and then I saw her face. And now I'm thinking, and then I saw her face. I'm a believer. <laughs> oh, yeah. Such a good song. Alrighty, now we wait on these dudes. The next set, give them the snackies. The snackies to grow up big and strong. All right, well, yeah, I'm out of snackies, so um, you, you're, you gotta take what you can get. And that's what you got. Now we get the green ones. I could go and bring the other frogs over since they grew up, but I also want to make sure these stay rendered in so that they like actually work, you know? You have three more. Oh no, it was day one. Well, I hope that they go well and you feel good about how you've done on all of them. Oh, we have them in Denmark too now that I think about it. I hope you did good. There's still two more state tests, at least for me. Okay, yep, you guys both have at least two or three more. Well, I hope you, you both do good on them. Good luck. I'm gonna remember making this joke, but how do frogs know their car's working? They ribbit. <laughs> they ribbit. You know, I do love a good pun, so it's um that is that is totally acceptable. That's an amazing joke. Just just they ribbit it. <laughs> I like it. I like it. I do like me some puns, so it, it's a it's a good time. Bum, 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 bum. I'm glad that um I was able to get stream working again and that the Wi-Fi like came back even though it's spotty you know we we got it back it's annoying that it had to cut out at all but we got it back so that's good ba -da -ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Oh my god, what's those oh, Yeah, don't forget that froglets can be picked up by any means. Even your hand, just like barrier books. You can pick up the frog lights and shulk ourselves. It's been less spotty for a while. Okay, that's good to know. I'm glad. I mean, beacon. Oh, like beacon blocks and shulker shells. Okay, gotcha, good to know. I'm working on an animation of some of my OCS and I'm really liking how it's turning out. Awesome, that's so cool, Sunny. I'm glad you're you're happy with how it's turning out so far. It's always a good feeling when, you know, the things you're working on feel like they're, they're doing good, they're panning out. These guys are so cute. I feel like certain things in Minecraft could be like a, a stream loading screen. It's just kind of fun, you know? We just gotta wait till we get the little green ones. They're cute though. But we just get to chill. Chill and watch little froggies from the mountaintops. It's a good time. 
walk past a debate of some type and I ask myself, they ask a lot of questions. <laughs> oh, got him. I recently just lost a mod in Minecraft world that I've been playing nonstop for like six months because your file got corrupted. Oh no. Fun fact, my very first YouTube series that I did, I posted episode one for it and then uh, somehow the world got deleted and I couldn't figure out why it did that. And then like, I had to restart all over again. I had like built a house for the starter house, like episode one, I like did all the classic things. And then when I went back to do episode two, it was just gone. So I just restarted and ended up liking my, um, the base location. I ended up actually like living on a mushroom island. But um, after I'd already made the new world, like rebuilt everything, I uh, then figured out that if I delete um, a world save, like if I accidentally delete a Minecraft world, if I check on my computer in the like recycling bin, it was there, it was in the recycling bin. So I just like removed it from the trash and put it back where it belonged. Yeah, I got the world back, but I'd already re restarted, so I just left it alone. <laughs> but I, I learned the valuable lesson of um, if you accidentally delete a world, you can get it back from your recycling. Uh, at least in my case. I'm not sure if all cases are that way, but in my case, I was able to find a way to get it back. So that was fun. I got a silly question, but if you have fire res on the boots, will you be okay jumping into lava? If you have fire res... You can you still take damage, but or if you have the yeah like fire protection on your boots, you still take damage. It's just less. So if you have like fire protection, the more fire protection you have on your armor, I think the less damage you take. If you have netherite, then it doesn't burn in lava. That's the thing. So if I died in lava, right, I would lose all of this in my inventory. I would lose my wings. I would lose everything, but I would be able to go back to that same spot in the lava and the the boots, the pants, and the helmet would be floating in lava. So that's the one good thing about the uh, the good old netherite. But um, yeah, fire protection enchant on like boots or your armor just makes you take less fire damage, which is what I, uh, that's my assumption at least. I could be wrong. But that's my understanding of it. You can walk on magma blocks. Wait, you can walk on magma blocks with fire protection and you won't get your toesies burned? I didn't know that part. That's cool. I'm also gonna sweep. Take a little snooze, a little honk shoe. Okay, but I wanna share that I recently got someone of a job. You did, Leah? That's so exciting. Congratulations. There was a goat jumping in the sunrise. That was that was funny. That was great. Congratulations on the job. That is very exciting. I hope it goes well for you. Your boyfriend was fixing it for hours so that I could still play in the mod pack. So I'm so grateful for him. Oh, that's so nice that he spent the time to do that for you. That's very kind of him. That's uh, great that you play. Playing it. Oh, I wondered about the free cam too. I thought it was because she was recording the gameplay of something. Oh no, yeah. I um I do use free cam when I record stuff, but I also use it if I'm like building. If I'm like, you know, if you're just working on the build, you're like placing the things, you can't always get a good vantage point, but I can back up to see different angles. Do I like how the build's turning out? That kind of a thing. So that's usually why uh, I use it. But sometimes it's just nice, you know, to take a little step back and like see things, kind of get a, like a quick lay of the land of areas. If an area looks a little spooky, like there's gonna be a lot of mobs down there, I can kind of free cam a little bit down into the, the space. But I use it for building mainly. Never mind the one for walking on map is Frost Walker. Wait, Frost Walker? You can walk on the magma blocks? I know you can walk on water and it turns to ice with Frostwalker. That's interesting. What are good recording programs for Minecraft? Um, I use OBS to record my Minecraft and it's free. So I would recommend that one. 
you can like record just the gameplay and all the Minecraft sounds, or if you're gonna like record stuff, you can also um, record your voice if you have a mic. You just set up all the different channels, which there's plenty of uh, YouTube channels that teach you how to set it up. So you could find those if you're, if you're curious. I'm hoping to apply for a full-time job at your workplace. Ooh, that's exciting, Ben. I hope uh, whatever the process of like applying or interviewing or like asking about that, I hope that that goes well and in your favor. That's exciting. I think it's actually has to be Frostwalker for the magma blocks. I'm, I'm curious now. That's interesting. Full fire resistance on at least two pieces of equipment makes it so you take zero fire damage even from lava blocks. Oh, interesting. Okay. Learning things today. I just wasn't sure about how you could use free cam if it was something you could do when you're recording. But now I know it's a mod. Yes, yes, sorry. Yeah. Free cam is a mod that I added into my Minecraft. So you don't need to, it's not like a recording specific mode. It's just a mod that you can apply and like if you don't record, you can still just use free cam. Yeah. Yes, yes. You know, for giving these guys the, the snackies, they are taking a long, long time to grow. I'm I'm kind of surprised, guys. But I guess I like I put them in here last and then I went back over there, so it makes sense that they're gonna take longer. Oh, speaking of Yes, the snackies worked. All right, two more. I, what color frog is your guys' favorite? I'm just curious. We've been, you've gotten to see all three of them so far. But I'm curious which one is your favorite color. It has the same effect as the fire rest potions. I made them in the Game of Thrones scenario. Oh, interesting. I didn't know that had the same effect as like the potions. Also, you were like the potion king. Um, that was so, so helpful for that scenario. Dude. Stay on the mountaintop, please. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. He's like, what if I don't want to? What if I want to leave? <laughs> Green, the brown one. Nice. Green's gotta be my favorite, a classic girly. The classic froggy. The classic frog. They are pretty cute. I just think like how they move and everything is just the best, so they're all cute. The frog scents to go and want to eat it. Can you imagine? It was like, we're gonna go find a goat. You know, while we're waiting for these ones, we could try to grab a goat horn, like from a goat. Should we see if there's like one nearby? We can get bumped, get a little get yeeted. Ow. It'd be kind of fun if we could get a goat horn, right? Hey, hello, hello, hi. You wanna, you wanna grab me? You wanna punch? Yeah, look at me, right against a wall. Whoa, it's like the perfect backdrop. Whoa. Yeah, yeah. Also, the goats are just cute. Okay. All right. We've got an East Red Rover. <laughs> Red Rover, Red Rover, Etho sends his people right over. Is that what we're going with? Is that? <laughs> oh my goodness. Y'all agreed to say Red Rover coming into Red Stream. My goodness. Well, Etho, thank you for bringing your people over. We are doing the, the hatching of the little froggos. We've gotten the, uh, the green ones almost hatched. We have two left to hatch. Oh, never mind. They, they escaping. We got them all. Yo, yo, come back here. Okay. Let me wrangle these guys and I can say hello to everyone new coming in. My goodness gracious. My goodness, Rick, Frogos Pog. Yes, we're going for the Frogos. We're going after the froggies. They have green frogs. Yeah, they do. They have green ones, like the white ones, and then orange ones. But you have to be in specific biomes to with the tadpoles to get certain ones. So we've just been taking our bucket of tadpoles and then making little like hatching enclosures in the different biomes that you need. But yeah, you get you get green ones. They're pretty cute. Very fun. Hope you have a good stream. My chat is making fun of me. So have fun babysitting them. Oh gosh. 
You guys trolling, trolling eat though. I love how you guys are saying Red Rover. That is actually super funny. Okay, I'm gonna scroll up and try to call out names. This is gonna take a bit, but thank you guys so much for popping in. I appreciate you guys. If you're curious how we vibe, there's exclamation mark rules to make sure that everything is, oh my gosh, I hear a child. Where did I hear that? I just heard a child. Did you hear a child growling? I heard a child growling. Why are you, this is, this is snow. Why are you here? Get out of here. Bruh. Okay. Clearly I'm great at this. Yep. Yeah. Okay. That, that's fun. Child. No, 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 no. Okay. All right, I'm gonna pause this so I don't have any more things coming in to get to me. Not a good time, but thank you guys so much for stopping in. Uh, let's see here, we've got, we're gonna scroll up a little bit. I'll just say some names and then we'll continue on. We got all of our frogs, so now we're gonna go back through. But Blanco, Who, Eric, Mary, Michael, Shu, Elena, CA, Alex, Rosangela, we've got Zunrise, thank you, Sierra, Shot, we've got Rome, we've got Endo, thank you guys, Taylors, <laughs> Leah, you're all, everyone, <laughs> Leah, you're also saying Red Rover, you're hopping on the, the train, Shots, Southless, Lunastar, Math Matthias is welcoming everybody in, thank you, Matthias. Endo, successful, we've got everyone coming in, Ronald, Christian, lovely, thank you everybody, the beast, princess, all of y'all, welcome on in. So, I was just asking my chat, what's your favorite uh, of the three frogs? A lot of people were saying green, but in the chat, tell me what your favorite frog type is. And we're gonna start moving these guys back to our area. So hopefully um, this won't be chaos, but I guarantee moving all these froggos will be chaos. But yeah, let me know which one you like. We've got whites, greens, whites, whites, orange. So many people, so many people, so many friends. Well, hopefully if you guys enjoy just some, you know, some chill Minecraft, some chatting, we do a lot of just listening to lo-fi and hanging out. So we're a pretty relaxed, chill environment. We always try to be welcoming and kind to everybody. Ooh, it's raining. Come on, guys. I'm hoping none of these guys take fall damage. Blue. Blue's not even then. You like all of them. Poppy likes the orange. That very nice. Okay, so we got a good mix of all of them. I just, I, I was saying I just like all of them because they're just so cute. Like, just how they walk, their little toes, their little toes and how they ribbit is just the cutest. We just have to be very, very slow because in our walking because I don't want them to hurt themselves. They take fall damage, which shouldn't be a thing for frogs, but it is. See, what you don't know is I'm actually your best friend. Oh, are you now? Well, everybody is welcome in my chat. As long as you, you know, check the stream rules, abide by the stream rules, you're kind to- Oh my gosh, no, I don't want powdered snow for my friends. Oh my gosh, please don't land in powdered snow. Okay, thank you. Come on, buddies. White is the best frog, that's your favorite one. Nice. Yeah, I, I just think they're all fun. They're all a good time. All right, now we just bring them through the forest. It's also really funny just like seeing them like sliding you know, like I just, it's so funny even just carrying them around. She's very chill. Yes, we are very chill. Red, of course, likes creeper toes. <laughs> yeah, Rebel is right. I do think that the toes that creepers have, they're cute. You know, deadly, deadly toes, but still cute. But I just, I just like the cute things in Minecraft. So, you know, can you really blame me? The AI chat summary is wild because it told me the chat was talking about witches and frogs and chat was trying to warn Red. Really interesting. I mean, there's no... I thought the sheep was a skeleton because it's getting dark. I was about to panic. I need to keep my frogs alive. 
Uh, Frogs is correct. The, the AI like summary thing uh, was right on that. That's also interesting. There's like a whole, oh, okay. Okay, I, I see how this is. Is it dark enough to sleep? Oh, it is, okay. <gasps> Hi buddies, look at them, they're so cute. Creeper toes, yes. Just like the pixel toes, you know? Just just looking at the pixels, it's kind of cute. That's what I was like referring to. I don't want that creeper to see, or that skeleton to see me. We're gonna go this way. Okay, all right. We're gonna focus, well, um, but I'm not like super close friends with him, I would say, more of just like, we're in the space together, you know? He's raided me. It's been great, so kind of just uh, got to know him through that briefly. But uh, what were you guys up to in Etho's stream? Were you doing Minecraft with Etho or was he playing some other, really? Really? I have to deal with you guys being around too? Not okay, not okay. We're gonna sneak away. But yeah, what was uh, Etho up to? Interesting, right? <laughs> Jennifer's judging me for liking little pixel animal toes. <laughs> well, it, I guess, you know, it, it, it's a creeper. I, I could see how, you know, that weird. But I don't know. I just think it's cute. All right, we'll make a boat. Travel by boat should be safer. We're we good, all three? Yeah, okay. Perfect. He went to the nether. He was playing hardcore Minecraft. Ooh, fun. He went to the nether, was trying to cure his villagers. Okay. Did, was he successful? I'm your professional babysitter now. Wow, look at that. What, was he able to like cure the villagers or did he just like get the blaze? Where was he kind of, uh, kind of at? Yes, he was successful, he got it. Good, this is lower and all of that kind of a thing. All of it. He's totally skilled. Nice, he cured them. Great. He also let his mods ban a bunch of people. You know, if people aren't listening to the rules of a stream, you, you learn the hard way. Play silly games, win silly prizes. Am I going the right way? Wait, there's a whole nother way to get over here? Hold up a second. We're using the free cam. Huh. Where did I go? Oh boy. I was just about to say like, this doesn't look familiar, so I'm clearly in a new area. Funny, okay. I might have just gone on the other side. All right, now we get to, now we get to go and figure out where and how we get back home. It was a war between the viewers. Many of them doubted him, others kept cheering him on. Oh, sure. So kind of like trolling too much. Okay, everyone read what might be silly. Yes, okay, so one thing I can note is earlier today, my Wi-Fi was being annoying and my Wi-Fi completely like just died. Like I had no Wi-Fi for like an hour. So my stream has been a little bit weird. So if it ever starts buffering for you, just refresh the stream. Um, I am sorry that that is the state of things. By stream, literally, so this is the second stream that I've done tonight because the first one, I ended up, it ended up just dying. Like my Wi-Fi just killed the stream. It went away. I had to like completely unplug and reset my modem, do all of that. So bro, I am like way far away from my area. Hello, we are going adventuring and I wasn't even trying to. <laughs> This isn't my village. What? Oh, I know where we are. This is the ruined village by my spawn. Okay, okay, okay. But yeah, so um, if you are noticing any issues with the Wi-Fi, like the connection to the stream, you can try buff, like re, refreshing it and see if that works. Um, it could also just be my internet being weird because that is the state of things. I have to like pay for a technician to come out and like 
fix things and reinstall things tomorrow morning. So that'll be my, my work day at the beginning of the morning. Okay, so I know where I am now. So based on this, this ruined portal is across from where I spawned in because there's this village. So we were over here. So if we keep going this way, we will get to where we need to be. Excuse me, you're supposed to be on the leads. So we're just gonna go up the hill and we should get back to where we need to be. Poor stream, I know it was so sad. So you know how some people say that like, oh, it's a Monday, all right. Cause like things just sometimes just don't go to plan on a Monday. Well, today my wife, I decided it was Monday and just, just isn't working, but it's uh, it's gotten better. It's still like a little laggy every once in a while, but it's gotten a lot better uh, is what my mods were saying and noticing. So if uh, you feel like sticking it out and vibing, you know, we just kind of chill and relax. We're just a calm, chill community. Um, you can stick around, but if the lag is too much and too annoying, I completely understand, like I get that. Lag is definitely annoying because it's annoying me. <laughs> All right, I think this connects back to where we need to be. Otherwise, we're just going on a grand adventure together. Okay, yeah, okay, I know where I am. So I found a, a wild pink sheep over here. These are the cherry trees. This is where we were doing the, uh... wow, I like ran across the savannah the wrong way. This biome looks nice. Yeah, it's a very nice one. I remember that village, I think. Yeah, because in one of my uh, YouTube videos, I had planned to make the... <gasps> Wait, do I? Oh gosh, I thought I only had one frog. Everyone else was under the water and I was like, are you kidding me? I lost them all. But I wanted to make a video out of converting that uh, like zombified village and like transforming them, getting them, you know, all cured up, but it didn't actually work. All right. Don't hit the dudes. Hey, come back here, dudes. Come here and come here, perfect. But yeah, so I, I did try an attempt to convert the people in the village, but <laughs> literally all the villagers died because they're out in the sun and the only villager that survived was the nitwit. So kind of funny. So I think they're just still in the village, like hanging out, but I was like, well, I'm not getting cheaper trades from you, so. You can just enjoy. What shaders are you using? I have, oh yeah, Archie just did the command. I use complimentary shaders. Ba -dum -ba -bum. But yeah, I'd say complimentary shaders is one of my favorites. You're an amazing streamer. Ah, oh, well thank you, Mr. Beast. Ha, I called you Mr. Beast, the beast. I'm sure you don't mind if I call you the Mr. Beast, right? I wonder if people ever like confuse that, you know? I feel like anytime you see like a name like the beast, you just like kind of think, <sighs> me boating with these dudes, I'm gonna end up just like constantly <laughs> getting them stuck in my boats. Hey, Joshua, thank you so much for becoming a member to the community, welcome on in. You, uh, you now get all the access to the cute little emotes that are a part of being a member. Thank you so much. We get some exclamation hype in chat. Let's go. First time watching a live stream. Well, welcome on in princess. Hope you uh, enjoy your time. I try to just make my streams be just very chill, relaxing, you know, cause those are the types of streams that I enjoy watching. So if you like chill, relaxing Minecraft vibes with some slight chaos because just animals be animals, like it, it's, it's a good time. All right, I have all three here, right? Yeah, I have three. Oh gosh. Hello guys, come along with me. Come along. Yes, Ben's got all the little little emotes going. There we go. Mr. Beast is a big shot. He is a big shot. It's crazy. He does really good. For me, villagers can have good trades and bad trades 50-50. It's true, yeah. It depends, like if you want to keep re-rolling do i still have all three okay if you want to keep like re-rolling for them then you can get some good ones but it's also just a lot of work you know well big shot considering he helped africa yes he's been a very good influence you know helping out 
people in the world. I think it's great. You got scared for a sec. I thought one escaped. I did too, Sada. I was like, are you kidding me? I have to go boat and back to find these guys. I'm going to pick up my, uh, my little orange ones too. And we're going to sleep. But we've got some orange ones in here as well. But we're going to sleep before... We're going to take a snooze before things come and get to me. Hello, Ronald. Poppy, hello. First time too. TLS, welcome in as well. Hello. Oh, God, I don't know. I don't think Red Cell was off. What are you saying, Rebel? See, oh my gosh, Mountain, don't even, don't even say it. I know I didn't lose a frog because there's literally two hiding in the boat with their little eyeballs. And then this one right here. So I know I didn't lose a frog. All right, now let's get these guys. Nothing? Hey, what'd you say? I'm scrolling up Rebel. Oh, that must be really far up there, Rebel. <laughs> I, I, I didn't see. I didn't see. Hello, Anella, welcome on in. I didn't either. <laughs> see, Archie didn't either. See, yeah, I totally didn't say uh, I was going to get you a pet charge creeper. Oh my gosh. Yeah, they would be a friend that I, I look at at a far, far, far distance. All right, get you, uh, get you. Do I have all three on lean? So we're good. Now let's grab you guys. Oh, hang on. I wish that you could pick up some of the frogs without having like all the leads disappear every time you're trying to like grab additional ones. You know, like if, if that could be a thing, I would be very happy. All right, I think I have all the leads. Oh, nope, not all of them. Okay. Come here, Frago. Frago. Yes, Frago. Yes, Frago, you. Frago, you. Do I get them? Okay. Yes, we got them all. All right. <laughs> oh. How many of these do you think I'm going to lose, guys, on this adventure? Those, those charged creeper toes. Exactly. <laughs> I like to see your content too bad. I don't understand much English. That's why I don't write much. Oh, that's totally fair, Joshua. But I appreciate that you wanted to uh, become a member still to my channel. Thank you very much for that. Oh my, did I lose, oh my gosh. I lost all of the orange ones. You guys, you guys are silly. Did you know that? Did you know you're silly? Come here. Where's the other? This is like whack-a-mole, like surface so I can grab you. Okay, I got that one. If uh, my stream is all of a sudden getting a little laggy for you guys, feel free to refresh. I might do that every so often. <sighs> Keep having to hitbox these guys to free them, then get them back. Okay, I think I got them all. This is, this is chaos. <laughs> You know, part of today was going to be me also trying to go grab some allays. Yeah, that, that's looking real, real likely to happen at this rate. It's literally almost eight o'clock and I've just gotten frogs. Like, <laughs> oh, that's too funny. But to be fair, you know, we, we streamed twice within the three hours, right? Like we were just going hard at the streaming. We can understand you fine, Joshua. Yeah, you're totally okay. Totally okay. You got a few chapters on the science fiction book you're writing done and the readers who have seen the advanced draft seem to like it. That's awesome, Matthias. That's very exciting. I'm sure it feels really good to, you know, have people saying that they like it. Also, having the the boat positioned so that I can see all the frogs swimming. <laughs> it's so cute. Look at them go. <laughs> Axolotls are the same size as frogs. But how come you can put axles in the buckets? That's so true. Oh my gosh, guys. I learned axolotls. If you put a tadpole in the same water that an axolotl is, the axolotl will eat your precious tadpoles. We saw it happen. For some reason, I thought you wouldn't have time for a lace. Archie knew. Every time I'm trying to do something with frogs, there's just, there's just chaos. But look at the froggies when they swim. It's so cute. <laughs> uh, imagine when you get back and all the frogs die to a creeper. I I would log out 
I would rage log out. That would be, I don't do that really, like at all, but that would be the moment where that would happen. <laughs> the cutest predator, they really are. Except I didn't expect them to eat tadpoles for some reason. I, I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, Christian, that is the good point. You can put axolotls in the bucket and they're the same size as frogs. I agree. That is very strange. Do I have all of them? Okay, three green, three orange. Yep, okay, making sure. <laughs> Gotta keep checking. I just learned that while doing a test aquarium in a creative world. Really? Oh no. <laughs> yep, I had never heard of that being a thing. So we, um, I don't know if you guys like rewatching streams, but uh, if you rewatch this specific one, because I had two today, this one, um, yeah, we, we, we find that out. And um, I, I was quite shocked <laughs> for a long time. <laughs> How do you find a laze? So you can find them trapped inside woodland mansions or trapped at pillager outposts. So in pillager outposts where you usually have the iron golems, they will sometimes have a laze in the cages. But in the woodland mansions, you have to like go sometimes pretty far into the woodland mansions to find rooms where the, uh... okay, finally, we're, we're getting home. This is my fishing dock. Finally getting close. Rage logout is the thing you almost did with better Minecraft. Remember that, Red? What moment did I do that in? I feel like I just like blur these moments out of my mind and just try to forget them. I love our little fishing dock. It's so pretty. Red, your feelings on the Minecraft mod mine colonies? I don't think I've actually heard of that one. So, um... I, I don't have a whole lot of feelings on it because I actually don't know what that is. Pillager outposts are far more reliable than mansions since mansions are so rare. Yeah, I figured if we were gonna get to doing any of our, do I still have all of them? Okay, yeah, there's six. I figured that if we were gonna get to the point where we would work on them today, that I'd probably, okay. All right, now the trick is, getting them up here they are they are under they're under <sighs> they are under my water that is not how you're supposed to get on my docks guys there's there's protocol <laughs> gotcha <laughs> all right i guess we have to go to the normal dirt edge for these hooligans you lost a green frog yeah i know they're back there i'll, I'll get them thank you for pointing it out Okay. All right. Come guys, any day now. Oh my word. <laughs> yeah, Archie, definitely not having time for uh, <laughs> uh, the allays. Unless I just get super speedy in the last eight minutes of stream, you know? Also, uh, for those of you that are new and have uh, not left a like on the stream, I would much appreciate it. It really helps out the channel. If you're new and haven't given a like to the stream, I appreciate it. Helps push my, my streams and my content to people that haven't, you know, seen it yet. Thank you, thank you. Hey, did you get the allays? Hey, Luna the Star. I have not gotten the allays. I've had quite the ordeal getting these little hooligans. So it's, uh, it's taken us a bit. My, my stream crashed. Oh my gosh. You, you are not making this process go quicker. But my, uh, my stream crashed cause my wifi died at one point. So we're, we're back. So beautiful. Thank you, Poppy. I appreciate it. I'm glad you like it. Oh yeah, guys, if you have not seen my, my little uh, world, I have a YouTube series and this is my cozy bamboo world in 120. So this is what uh, some of my builds are. We've got our starter house. We've got a little axolotl pond. We've got our bridges, our pagoda, storage room, our little panda sanctuary, little bee house. I've got an animal barn. We've got a little dragon temple where we killed the dragon, which I actually killed the ender dragon with a piece of bamboo. I have a video on my channel if you're curious how that went. It was successful, but I have a pink sheep that lives in here. But this is my little base area that I've developed if you guys haven't seen my place. So I love building cozy things. That's that's my vibe is just cozy. So this is uh, what we have. You guys, you guys gonna follow me? Okay, come along. 
you subscribe thank you so much for subscribing i appreciate that means a lot that you think my content is worth uh, coming back to hello gold welcome on in thank you michael and everyone saying how cool it is i appreciate that I love this place. It's super nice. Thank you. Yeah, I'm a big fan of it. It's super cozy. I think my one of my favorite builds is my um, bee house. So if I just use free cam, I can kind of sneak in here. But this is my one of my favorite builds is where all of my bees live. I, I think it's so cozy. I love it. Love all the cozy builds. But yeah, we're going to bring all of these little uh, froggies over to our pond where our axolotls are. Who's your favorite YouTuber? Um, I don't really think I have like a favorite. Um, the people I watch pretty regularly are Drift and Brookella and Sev and Sparkle and Frog Crafting. Um, I also like watching Gem, Sausage, like some of the Empire's cast I think are good. I just like watching, oh my gosh, I lost two. Y'all, y'all, what you doing you sillies? But I mostly just like it depends on what I feel like watching, you know. All right, let's let's uh, let's sleep in our house, and then we're gonna go get those two other frogs that got stuck in a boat down by the docks. Oh, have you tried to get a sniffer yet? Oh, I do have sniffers. I can show you my sniffer sanctuary. Do you watch a puma? Um, I don't watch her stuff very much. Like I think I looked her up one time, her channel because I hadn't heard of her before. So I was just curious, um, but if I just use free cam again, this is my little sniffer sanctuary. They, we've, they've all got little names, but we've got a nice little like uh, tunnel to get to them. It's all cute and cozy. So we've got a little little entrance with the sniffers on the pots. But yeah, that's what it uh, looks like. But let's go grab our other guys. So they have to go. This is my first time on your channel. I love this stream. Ah, oh, well, thank you so much, Michael. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Thanks for uh, sticking around for the stream. And I hope you have a good rest of your day. Thanks for stopping in. Bum, 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 bum. Uh, can I ask you a question? You can ask me a question. Go for it. Sveya, hello. How are you doing? It is good to see you in chat. We're uh, almost done with stream. I'm going to just try to wrangle. I'm trying to wrangle frogs. Um, it's been a little chaotic, <laughs> so, um, that's what we've been working on, but how's it going? Hope you're doing good, Svea. All right, let's see if they'll, they'll jump up. I don't think they're gonna jump up. Do you wish you can fly in the sky? I think it would be interesting to fly. It would be kind of funny, though, because if you... Okay, you know what? These guys aren't gonna... You guys are just gonna get stuck. Whoa. We're just gonna go this way. It would just be a, a bummer, you know, if you're just flying and you fly through a bunch of bugs. Things like that. Oh, puffer fish! Careful, frogs. That that fish is not your friend. Everything stays in the garden and it's beauty. Yes, I do love all the cozy things. I try to just... Basically, like, my aesthetic is very just, like, overgrown cozy big fan of that type of a build style but yeah uh this is my little base area this is my most recent build this is actually a wool farm so if i just put my little my little head in here we've got our sheep modules all the way up to the top so we've got our our lighthouse that is a, a wool farm so it's kind of fun and we've just got a big line of hoppers collecting all of it. But I, this is my most latest video on YouTube from this world for like a let's play video. And I, I love it. I was so happy with how this all turned out and like the color palette. I was a big fan, big fan. Bum, bum. You, do you wish you could bring one of your girlfriends to fly in the sky? I mean, going with friends is way more fun than going alone. So I suppose. Have you done a hardcore world? <laughs> uh, yes, I uh, have done a hardcore world. It lasted four whole episodes. So if you're curious how I survived four whole episodes on hardcore, uh, you can check my my channel. There's a playlist for it. Um, yep. 
learn something new about about Minecraft um, from that death. So good times. But um, I'm actually going to be starting a duo hardcore world with my mod Rebel. What the Rebel who's in here right now. So we're going to start a new hardcore world together and I'll be streaming it here on YouTube like Tuesdays, like I usually stream on Tuesdays. So I am gonna be doing another attempt at hardcore. So we'll, uh, we're will we hopefully gonna last for a while, survive it, but we'll see. I need to gather frogs in my world so I can get frog lights. I've never used them before and they look so cute. Ooh, yes, good luck with it. Um, you need to bring your frogs into the nether and the smallest magma cubes are the ones that they, they'll like munch on and convert them to the frog lights. And then you can kind of like Google, depending on the color of frog light that you want, uh, then you can figure out which color frog you bring to the nether. But good luck with that. I, uh, in my 119 series, I converted, I like completely transformed a uh, treasure bastion. There we go. Oh my word, I lost another one. You goon, where did you go? Right? Yeah, you little silly. Where did you go? You get stuck on the bamboo. No, don't go by the cactus. Don't go by the cactus. Oh my gosh. Um, but in my 119 series, I transformed a treasure bastion completely. Like all of the black stone became just stone brick colors. And that was my frog light farm as well. So that was a super fun project, but also a very grindy project. That took me so long. Right, if you need uh, Minecraft knowledge, you have my discords. So you can ask me anything. All right, good to know. Thank you, Matthias. I appreciate it. Honestly, think you would enjoy watching Lily Mations. All right, good to know. Good to know. Maybe you should make a frog like garden or four sorta. Yeah, I plan to use these guys to make some frog lights. Um, I do just want to make them a little frog sanctuary, like in my base. Like I think I want to make a frog sanctuary kind of back here is my thought. So we'll do, oh, hi dude, coming out of the nether portal. But that's kind of like my plan. But yeah, um, this is the time though. This is the usual time I end stream. So thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. If you're new, I appreciate you sticking around through Ethos Raid, kind of getting to hang out with me, uh, watch me kind of wrangle frogs and shenanigans. But uh, we've been streaming for three hours, so we're gonna end it here. But thank you guys so much for hanging out. And yeah, thank you so much uh, again for those that became members. I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. And thank you to everyone who stuck around. Hope you guys have a good rest of your day. Do something nice for someone and have a cozy rest of your week. And I will see you next Tuesday, 5 p.m. Central Time CST for another stream. Have a good day, guys. Thank you.